So this is a benzene ring. Oh, jeez. It's got six black carbons in a hexagon and six white hydrogens coming out of it. Now, this looks like there's three rings here. And if you're SL, and this is after all in the SL section, this looks a bit confusing. In reality, the benzene ring also has a ring of electrons around the top and a ring of electrons around the bottom of the benzene molecule. If you're higher level, those are the pi electrons. But for SL, you need to know this ring at the top, ring at the bottom. Now, these rings of electrons make benzene more stable than you'd expect. So it's actually very difficult for chemicals to break this benzene ring. These rings of electrons make the benzene ring very hard to break. But you can swap out these hydrogens. Now, these electron rings at the top and bottom mean that the benzene is susceptible to electrophiles. Electrophiles are something that love electrons. So what electrophiles do the IB want you to know about? Well, the first one is chlorine. Now, that's strange. Chlorine loves electrons. Well, I mean, each chlorine atom has quite a high electronegativity, but this is a neutral molecule. How does this neutral molecule become attracted to these negative rings? Well, uh, if you look at the equation, you need something called aluminium trichloride or aluminium chloride in order to come along. The aluminium chloride will grab this Cl with two electrons off, leaving behind Cl plus, which is quite an unusual species. Now this Cl plus is an electrophile. It, uh, it loves electrons. It's going to come on in and it's going to swap out with one of the hydrogens. This is called substitution. Substitution is just a posh name for swapping. And if you've got more chlorine, then you can swap out even more of these hydrogens. The second electrophile, the IB want you to know, electron loving thing, uh, is this. This is NO2 plus. Now, how do you make that? Well, you have to stick nitric acid with sulfuric acid and heat it up to 50 degrees. But this NO2 plus loves electrons. It's an electrophile. It comes on in and it can't break the ring. Remember, the ring between the carbons here is very stable. It can't break that. But it can swap or substitute out one of the hydrogens. And this makes nitrobenzene. And of course, if you have more and more of this stuff, you can put more and more nitros on. So a bit... Oh man, good afternoon, Russia. But I do have a nice little board here. That's Grant Imalahawa from Mythbusters. I was excited when I was given this million dollar bill. Turns out it's a creationist propaganda. There's the real Dr. Atkinson and me. Oh, I'm looking a bit fat in that photo. And uh, some artwork from the student. God Emperor Thornley. Killing the IB, maybe. And a rather flattering image as well. I think that kid wanted a good report for his parents. <laughs>